I've worked on a ton of different projects where there's more than one agency involved. And I can honestly tell you, the fastest way to tank a project is to have a weak client. Don't be that client. And so this morning I'm in a meeting with a client and they share with me that they might be bringing in another agency. It's really not a big deal. We work often with other agencies and it works every single time as long as you follow this one rule. Okay, so lucky for me, I have a cameraman who follows me so you can <laughs> check out that meeting right now. And the only thing that I, I will say, having done this for a long time, is either you need to be really in control and dictate to them what their mandate is and dictate to me what our mandate is, or you have to put me in control or you have to put them in control. <laughs> Somebody has to be leading the project. If the comp analysis and the brand strategy we do and the video creative we create dictates the approach for the rest of the campaign, then you need to put us in control and we'll work with you and then they will implement what we've developed. If you want their strategy, so their PR strategy, to actually lead the campaign, then they will create a PR strategy and they will give us the, they will give us the placement for the video and we will create a video to work within their strategy. If you want us to work side by side, then it needs to be a triangle and we need to both come to you and you kind of have to make a decision on a case by case basis so we're not bumping into one another. So I'm not sure if I did a great job explaining it or not, but where I was getting with the triangle is the fact that if you are the client and you do not have knowledge about marketing or about sales or whatever it might be, you could be renovating your house. Right? Think about yourself. You are renovating your house. You want to have this big dream. You know exactly what it is you want to do. But you're not going to connect the plumber to the electrician and just say, you guys figure it out and come back to me. You're going to lead the project. Are you going to hire a general contractor? Or are you going to hire a construction manager? Because the thought of just allowing the electrician and the plumber to figure it out amongst themselves and then come back to you, it's almost silly. If you're trying to figure out your future plans and you're working with a lawyer and an accountant, you have to be a strong client. You have to set the direction and your lawyer and your accountant report back to you and you make the decisions. Or maybe your lawyer is in charge. They set the strategy and the accountant is gonna to report to the lawyer's strategy and make it work and then they give it to you. Or maybe it's the other way around. Maybe the lawyer is working with the accountant, under the accountant and the accountant sets a strategy and they give it to you. Either way, you have to put someone in charge of this project. If you are not gonna lead it, you have to put someone in charge so that way they set the direction and everyone else falls underneath. And in my experience, no one has an ego in this. There's no agency person who wants to grab control and make sure they're leading everything. We all work really well together, provided we know what is expected of us. So if you're playing in the client position, if this is for your company, if this is for your business, and you don't have a sense of what needs to happen, then please put someone in charge of the project and have everyone fall underneath them. Don't assume that you're somehow gonna bring in two or three or four different companies or different vendors and think they're all gonna get along together. It creates a crazy love triangle where everyone starts blaming other people because there's just no leader. Be the leader or make someone else the leader, but you can't have a vacuum. You can't not put someone in charge. You're gonna waste all your time, you're gonna waste all your budget, and then you're gonna be pissed off and you're gonna blame everyone else. Be the leader, put someone else in charge if you have to, but just make it happen. Your lawyer sets the strategy. They set the, hey, Kyle. Hey. <laughs> they set the strategy.